But hello, admin also need a lot of work, right? They do a lot of work, you know? We open Word document, you know? We open YouTube, we open Facebook. Welcome back to another episode of CG's Tips Tech Talk! My name is Shamine, and if you do not know yet, in this channel we will uncover simple tips and knowledge about the ever-growing and intimidating IT-related topics. In the previous episode, we shared some tips and what to look out for when choosing your new laptop. So if you have yet to catch it, we'll leave the link at the top for you to pop over and have a look. In today's episode, we will be sharing with you on how you can select a suitable laptop based on your needs and occupation. It doesn't matter whether you're a working adult or still currently schooling. I, the little tech angel, will find a suitable laptop for you. So which laptop should you select for your different occupations? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, look, uh, give me a sec, okay. This one? Okay. So. For someone like me, I do a lot of sales pitches, um, a lot of sharings, and I travel around a lot. So I recommend something that is more lightweight and it's high mobility. Definitely consider a tablet laptop because it's convenient and it looks more presentable for your clients. So what I recommend is the i7U processor uh, with an inbuilt graphic card. And I also recommend a 256 GB SSD because you'll need to store all your presentations and Excel sheets and you'll need them on the go. I would also recommend like a 16 GB RAM because you'll have to open presentations and videos at the same time when you're presenting to your clients. I would also recommend you a touch screen because it will just make it easier when you present it to your clients. Uh, I've got a call. Okay, I gotta go, yeah. That's about it. Okay, bye. Hi! Hello, I'm Cheryl, yeah. So, for an admin position like me, or if you're an accountant or office worker, a basic PC tower will work best for you. But if you really want some portability, yeah, a portable laptop, you can consider that too. Here are some basic specifications you can take note of. I would recommend a i5U processor because it's rather basic, but also gives you a solid performance. Yeah, take a look at an inbuilt graphic card as well. And also, I would recommend an 8GB RAM memory because, uh, you know, my friends always tell me 4GB is enough. But hello, admin also need a lot of work, right? They do a lot of work, you know? We open Word document, you know? We open YouTube, we open Facebook. YouTube! <laughs> YouTube! <laughs> no, 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 I never say YouTube, yeah. Can you help me? Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, other than that, you can also take a look at a 256GB SSD storage. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> My name is Vanessa and I work in the creative industry. So for all of you creatives out there, I will recommend you choose a laptop that has high power to handle graphically intensive applications. And also, you will need a lot of storage, so the more the merrier. The more storage, the more ideal. So here's what you'll need minimally for your laptop. Firstly, maybe you want to consider an i7H or K processor because most of the time you'll be multitasking and also you'll probably open two or more programs at the same time. Do take a look at an inbuilt graphic card. Or if you do more 3D, you might want a higher end graphic card. And I recommend you take a look at a 256GB SSD and also a 1TB HDD. Why? It's storage, dear. You're going to need all the storage to store your creative projects. That's all I can offer. Yeah, I know it's expensive, but honey, you're going to need it. So go and take a look. Ah, yes! Do follow me on my Instagram at 32 For other designations like programmers, designers, or gamers, you might need to opt for something with higher specifications to support your scope of work. That's all for today. Leave us a comment below and let us know what you would like us to uncover next. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our videos. And see me, the mighty little cute tech angel, in the next episode of CG's Tips Tech Talk. Shutting down.